Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Who do I sound like? Hi, how are ya? Okay, anyways, um, controversial flag exposed. That's okay. So I came on here because I have discovered a- I've discovered something amazing! Again! Ah! Brand new way to do laundry, and I probably didn't discover it. People will probably do this, and I'm. You're asking why am I in the kitchen? Um, because I'm still working on putting my life together. So, I wanted to tell you guys about how I do my laundry with no washer and no dryer. And you might think I'm crazy, but it's okay because I've had to live in my car before. So this is bougie to me, to be honest. And I'm not going to the laundromat. I'm over it. Guys, I'm gonna show you the setup. Um, I just started it, okay? So here's all of my like clothes hanging. Um, I use a laundry basket because it makes it easier to like irrigate. And irrigate, yeah, yeah, yeah. Move around, wash them, you know what I mean? So I start filling up my tub and once it gets like halfway, which there's only a couple clothes in here and some washcloths, I do my detergent and I use a lot of softener and that might be problematic, but it's okay. Um, obviously, as you can see, I have my shower bar up here for my curtain. I bought another one to put over top of my shower head. I can literally still shower without these clothes getting wet. They say I'm short, but it, it does come with benefits, okay? Um, it works. So, basically, I, I always start with my softener. Um, because, like, you don't want to use a lot of soap in this situation. And plus, I really don't have that many clothes. I don't like to leave the softener like sit on the clothes for too long though because it like can start staining it. It's really weird. I'm only going to use like a half cup of soap and when like this is actually like a new trend I'm guessing uh, it, people call it stripping their clothes which is literally just old fashioned washing clothes. And then when the water starts to get up to this level, I start <clears throat> to spray just to get the tops of the clothes. I probably won't do a whole lot of water for the. It's um, like a really tiny load. So basically, I just get them all like really soaked. And once they are good and soaked, I go ahead and just like let the water still run. I let my clothes sit for about five minutes in the like soapy water <clears throat> and then I get it in here and I like rub the crap out of them and really get like my clothes get super clean like way more clean than they do in the washer and like this thing holds a lot of weight because I've put like blankets on this so and it doesn't fall because it has that like little ledge but you could get something even more like sturdy like maybe like a wire tension wire um but this is just my setup for now so it's been about five or so minutes um normally like if the clothes are super dirty which they they really normally aren't <clears throat> um it starts getting kind of like the water starts getting kind of murky um because some of like the dyes and stuff i'm not gonna do the whole entire thing on camera because i need two hands but basically just like jiggling it around a lot kind of like working the soap in and out through the laundry and this is a really light load too so i'm gonna spend maybe like three four minutes just kind of irrigating the crap out of it now it's gonna get cleaner well hi coco are you curious what's going on Oh my gosh, you guys are finally getting to see Koki. He's like obsessed with water. 
Hi, I'm on the floor. Um, I have attempted to do this exact little part of this video for so long. My mirror is dirty and I'm not okay with that. Basically, normally what I do is I have a bean bag in here on the floor, but it gets a little tight and I, the lack of toilet paper. Um, it gets a little tight in the bathroom <laughs> when I have a big bean bag chair in here. But anyways, so yeah, um, done washing these. The water, like, if the water gets dirty, don't worry because it's literally cleaning your clothes. So what I do is I kind of like push down, get a little bit more of the dirt out, you know, and then I drain them. Um, for this part... I used to have a basket that had holes like drilled into the bottom of it and on the sides but it really does like do the trick and it keeps your clothes in a tight little area too so. so this next part I haven't quite 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 what I haven't quite got down pat exactly pat and quite yeah, never mind. Just forget that I exist. Um, <clears throat> basically, <laughs> I've done it like a million and one ways, but since this is a light load, this is like the easiest way to do it. Just like tip her. <clears throat> um, don't think that I'm wasting water. I <laughs> literally am. I just want the soap out. The softener is fine. And then on this step, you can do like another cap of softener if you prefer to be wasteful, like me. <clears throat> um, so yeah, I just am spraying, since it's literally the smallest load in the world, I literally keep a laundry basket in here and fill it with like the delicate, the more delicate items. Sorry, my camera cut off. Oh my goodness. Um, but yeah, so <clears throat> I do like, <sighs> Like her, like she's thick. Like that hood, that sweatshirt. That was a beast to ring out. Um, the ringing out is my least favorite part. And that's why I like using warmer water because it, oh, your hands just get so like irritated. I've literally been spraying these clothes for like so long, it's like not even funny. Um, but yeah, like your hands get super irritated when it's super cold. Anyways, I let her drain like that for like five minutes. Everything is in five minute increments. I don't know. And then I come back in and I'll show you how I wring them out basically. Okay. Okay. I'll be back. Thank you guys again so much for clicking on this video. Um, I hope it was helpful. There's so many different ways to wash your clothes. So like if you need help, just message me or comment and I'll give you ideas because I've literally washed my clothes all different types of ways like this is gonna sound trashy but literally like I've washed my clothes in like a creek before but like I was swimming anyways um cocoa and pickles well Pickles is eating and Coco is watching, which is super creepy. Coco, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Anyways, so follow me, subscribe, like the video, question mark, I don't know, whatever you want to do. Um, if you liked it, leave a thumbs up. If you hated it, leave a thumbs down and comment why. We love constructive criticism. I say that way too much, even though I get butt hurt. Um, have a wonderful Christmas. That's the next holiday. Have a beautiful, wonderful Christmas. Um, hopefully more videos like this will be coming out soon. How to be broke with Skylar Ray. How about that? Okay. Hey, gonna hold my body down. No, there ain't no gray. Oh my body down